The third condition is that he doesn't want to be called Apus. Is that correct, Apus? <laughs> Assalamu alaikum guys and welcome to another episode of Smiles to Jannah. If you are looking for a good laugh then this video is going to be right up your alley. So Ali was debating with a guy who we call Apus, short for a pusillanimous. So Apus is a notorious and toxic ex-Muslim. His way of debating with Muslims is ripping up the Quran, insulting Allah and the Prophet sallallahu with the most disgusting, vile of words. So for the last couple of months Ali's been trying to debate him in person and he's been scurrying away into whatever damp, dark, crack and crevice he can find. Ali had a bright idea that he was going to rope him in to open curse challenge which Muslims know you can't do with an atheist and he managed to get Apus hook line and sinker but Apus was so gassed that he managed to get Ali. Yeah okay you're proud of that. Okay. I don't even know what to call him to be honest I think he's yet to be identified by the zoologists and of course he wanted to please his colonial overlords. Ali came in a suit whilst Apus looked like he was going to bed. He started breathing heavily as if he had seen a ghost. <laughs> He started rocking on his chair. Oh, beautiful, yeah. He was displaying yeah. pacifying and self soothing behaviors like fiddling with his pen and interlocking his fingers, not to mention the excessive blinking and the out of control stuttering. He's not that confident. That thalamus has kicked in. The amygdala has heard it. It's taken as a threat. Everybody, everybody. Every, everybody, everybody, area, everybody, 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 every, everybody. And the amount of basic mistakes that he was making, it's just embarrassing. And Question, there's this is the infinite works. amount of dependent things. Could be, I don't know. Oh my days, allow it! Don't chat to me, you said what? No, D dependent, what no, no, dependent, no. Sorry, How? dependent, no, that's. <laughs> this video is enough for any atheist, far-right, extreme Hindu to disown him completely. He simply cannot keep his composure under pressure. As the discussion progressed, he was losing control. Answer the question, come I'm on. I'm asking the question, yeah? Okay, um, what was the question? Ask again. <laughs> <laughs> and eventually, if he hadn't done so already, he broke him down and Apos just started swearing and going nuts. Oh yeah, well you're a p you No you can't, f*** off. Stop driving your taxi. Dude, are you dumb? Shut the f*** up. Wait, this guy couldn't even be bothered to repeat his own argument more than once. But then you try to refuge but, but but then He was asking for evidence, but when evidence was asked to him, it was like the biggest blasphemy against atheism had been committed. How does it show know. it to me? Show I it to me. Know. How does it? Okay, where's the evidence? You said you know. Oh. So what's the evidence? I don't know. I have to go. I have to go into my uh, into you my need to, brain. You need to do video. And You're gonna go I, I need to, video I need to go into my brain and pick out the pick out the knowledge well, that, I, that, that, that I knew. What's going on here? It's, it's lost the plot. Enough jibber jabber, guys. It was a two-hour-long discussion. And there's only two main things you need to know about it, yeah? First thing is that any knowledgeable Muslim knows that you can't do an open curse challenge with an atheist. And even if you do, there's certain ways of conducting it and doing it. This guy was pathetic. Dear Allah, if I am lying about Islam, if I am wrong deliberately, then please, right now, take my life. You Everybody, you're seeing this, right? You see the result? I'm not dead. That's an ex-Muslim. Wouldn't he know that Mubahala cannot be done with an atheist? Everybody, everybody. And number two, any atheist worth his salt knows when debating with a Muslim, you gotta know the contingency argument. I'm saying, do you accept a necessary being exists? I just talked to you about how it could be energy and you asked me questions about, about what energy. Possibly, okay, possibly, oh. that's what I said. Welcome to the Gulag, 
If you survive, you earn your freedom. He has accepted a necessary being, which means he cannot class himself as an atheist. Game over, mate. You're in the gulag and you're gonna stay there. Never call yourself an atheist again, mate. Find another profession. I have read quite many books. I don't, I just don't, I don't understand. How does a necessary being give rise to the dependent things, contingent things, but has no knowledge? How? Is something that we uh, uh -oh. philosophize and uh -oh. research and uh -oh. learn and further find out. I don't know what's going on here. It's, it's lost the plot. It's, it's completely lost the plot. I have read quite many books. Uh, I mean, you don't get to violate Muslims and then expect to be treated respectfully. And Jazakallah Khair to the likes of Ali who took out his time to neutralize this bug. And we could see, yeah, for our viewing pleasure, how Allah humiliated this individual. And any atheist or far right or whoever it is that's a fan of this guy, now's the time for you to jump ship. Before I end this video, I'm going to give you my top moments in that discussion, mate. It was pure comedy. Y'all, y'all can't dance. Hey, y'all be trying. Y'all be really. The third condition is that he doesn't want to be called Apus. Is that correct, Apus? <laughs> <laughs> A plus was, A plus two, to A plus two. <laughs> Oh, yeah. oh, I'm dead. I'm Your dead, he got me. He got me, he killed me. Your mouth is uh, moving a lot like a rat. And his wonderful voice. Yappa, 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 yappa. I love the... Shut it, place. Don't we all love to hear a down? Don't we all love to hear him? And we are so proud of that, aren't we? If there was infinite amount of apuses, may Allah protect us, and I slapped two and they and it died. Okay, how many apuses are there? <laughs> Fail, you failed, you're finished. <laughs> Stop! Yes, like I'm literally so gay. Are you finished? Yes. Because you are finished in a minute. It's the one and only Digo Double G. Again, King Cream in here. Don't be jealous. He's not that confident. That thalamus has kicked in. The amygdala has heard it. It's taken as a threat.